so sorry. I... Margaret, there must be something that you can do. Look, I thought getting you all here would help, would bolster her spirits, but... But what? It's not working. And the present medication's not working. I, I don't understand what's going on. I don't know what to tell you, except to pray. Yes. I called St. Mary's, and uh, Father Huntington is coming over. What'd you do that for? I thought it'd be a comfort to everybody to have someone here from your church. Because of Dinah? D Dinah's gonna be perfectly fine, Ross. I don't know what you're talking about. She's gonna be perfectly fine. Margaret, we don't need a priest. Bless her. But Miss, in her present condition. Hey, come on, Dinah. Open your eyes for me. Dinah, look at me. Look at me. It's hard. Say something. I'm trying hard. I'm trying, but it's... It's getting very hard. I took Vanessa's blood pressure pills just to scare you and make you want me, but I think I took too many. Look at me. It's me. Come on. Come on. No, I'm scared. No, don't be scared. I'm right here. You feel my hands? You feel my hands? All I ever wanted was... was to marry you. You want to get married, Dinah? You want to get married? We can get married, okay? Hey, we'll get married. You want to know? We'll get married. I'll marry you. I promise you I'll marry you, but you have got to open your eyes. I can't marry you like this, right? You got to stay with me. You got to open your eyes. We'll get married. I can't I'm die now. Oh, please, God, don't let me die now. Look at me. Look at me. May I speak with you for a moment? Dinah, do you hear what I'm saying to you? Stay with me, buddy. I'm sorry to interrupt, but her father, it's, it's Ross Marler, called okay. me. It's good that you're here. It's good that you're here. Um, he, he told me, I know. I, I came as quickly as I could. No, if you'll give me a couple no, no, of moments, no, no, I'll just No, 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 listen, 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 listen to me. I, 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 don't, I don't want you to talk about dying, okay? I'm just... Right now, your friend needs comfort, absolutely. Father, my, right now, what my friend needs is a wedding, okay? She needs a wedding. Excuse me? Yeah, I, I need you to marry us now. I, I want you to marry us right right now, right here. I'm sorry, marry. but I can't perform a wedding ceremony. Not now, not with no, her listen, like this. No, listen, you don't understand. You don't understand what's going on here, okay? I, I've let this woman down enough, okay? We, we need to do this for her. Do you understand? We need to do this for her. I'd please. like to help her be at peace. You want to help her? Do this for me, Father. Please do this for me, okay? A marriage is, is a holy union Father, between two Father, people. I don't need be... a lecture. I don't need a lecture. What I need you to do is I need you to marry us. That's all I need you to do. Please. Please. What are you talking about? Margaret, this is completely unacceptable. Do something. We're doing everything we can medically. I don't want to hear that. I don't want to hear that. I heard that before when I was very sick, and the only reason I'm here is because we didn't accept it. We got aggressive, and we found answers. Vanessa, you don't understand. She opened her eyes, Vanessa, and, and uh, she, she, the, the last thing she said she wanted was, was to marry right. me. No. No last anythings, all right? All right. You get on the phone, you get every specialist you know, and you get them here. You got that? I am not going to watch my daughter die. Mm, hey. Oh, <laughs> uh, well, you're becoming a permanent fixture around here, aren't you? Well, uh, not really. I, uh, I had to take care of some business. I just got back, actually. How is Dinah? She was, uh, she was doing better when I left, but uh, she's been through hell. I'm sorry. I, I mean, Dinah and I aren't exactly close, but I wish there was something that I could do. Well, just being here is good enough. I mean, showing your support. Why don't, why don't you pop in and say hi? Um, well, is, um, is Vanessa in there? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure she is. Well, you know, um, why don't I come back at another time? You and I wouldn't be intruding and, you know. Well, you're here now. You might as well... Well, I know, but I was i was just having dinner with my mother. I mean, that's the only reason... Well, just, you know, why, why don't I come back at another this, time? Uh, does this have something to do with Vanessa? No. No, no. <laughs> that sounds like a yes. <clears throat> you know. I don't know. I, I don't know. It would just be uncomfortable for me, okay? Why do you say that? Because 
Vanessa made it very clear she wants me to stay away from you. There's a new medical drug we could try, a new research drug. It's still in clinical trials. Now, there's some consent forms you'll have to sign because yeah. it could cause serious side effects. Are you sure you want to try this? Have you any other suggestions? The percentage of this drug's side effects triples in her age group. Doctor, go ahead. Go ahead. Just, just do it. How long before we'll know anything? Oh, I'd like to give you some hope. I really would. But none of the drugs we've tried on Donna have worked so far. They're just... We'll have to wait and see. Wait and see? Hey, can you hear me? You can hear me, right? You can hear me? Look at me. No, no, look at me. The priest's here, okay? But I need, I need you to hang on, okay? Diana, don't do this. Hey, come on, don't do this. Dinah. Dinah. Well, Margaret? This blood gas will tell us whether we need to put her on a ventilator. You, you, you know, you, I, I'm, 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 I'm trying to get through to her. I'm trying to get through to her, but Honey, nothing's really Dinah, happening. Dinah, sweetheart, don't give up, okay? Don't give up. Now, come on. You have a bright, beautiful life in front of you. You do. You really think she can hear us? Yes, Bill, I believe she can. Now listen, my darling. You lost your baby and you feel as though you have nothing to live for, but you... You got your family here with you. And we love you. And we need you. Okay? And we're gonna take care of you. You just... You just stay. Because you're still our little baby, you know. You are. You are, baby. No, 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 no. I want, I want you to marry us. I thought you I'd marry like us. to help you. I really would. But this is what she wants. Marriage is a holy union. This, this is what she wants. Right now, she wouldn't even know what's going on. I don't on. care. Do you understand? You're going to marry us. You're going to marry us now. Get it, now. Art. I want you to marry us. There's no way in hell that I would let you marry my sister now. What exactly did my uh, wife say to you? Well, you are married. Yes, I am. And, uh, Philip is involved with Harley, and Ben, well, Ben is, um, sort of wrapped up in Blake, and... Hello. What are you, what are you saying? This is a little embarrassing. Um, Vanessa said that I was chasing after all the unavailable men in town, and that you were taken, and that I'm no threat, which obviously I already knew that I was a what, threat, what, so... Vanessa's... That doesn't sound like Vanessa. But hey, she's got, you know, she's got a lot of stuff going on right now. I'm sure she was just letting off steam if she's, you know. Yeah, lots of steam. <clears throat> I'm sure she didn't mean it. I think she meant it, Matt. She thinks I have designs on you, and I don't. I mean, not that I'm not attracted to you, because... Uh, You marry my sister after what you've done to her, you are out of your mind. You put Dinah here. You got her pregnant while you were supposedly in love with another woman? What do you think that did to Dinah, huh? How do you think that made her feel? I know how that made her feel. Yeah, but it wasn't enough, was it? No, you had to make her lose her baby when all she was trying to do was cut loose from you. No. And now she's dying, and you want to do the right thing. Why? So you don't have to face your own guilt? No, Bill, is that it, Hart? Listen to me. She wants to marry me, Bill. She, no, she doesn't know what she wants. She is dying. She's dying because of what you did to her. You know, get the hell out of here. I don't want you. What are you anywhere near my son? I would take this guy. All right, both of you, shut up. Bill, stop it. You don't think I would do this to myself if I could? I can't do anything for her except do what she wants. I want you out of here. You hear me? I don't want you anywhere near her. All right, just shut up. Come on, let's go. Let's just calm down. Come on, come on. Vanessa, do you think I could just have a couple of minutes alone with her, please? Yeah, you can talk to her after you've killed me, too. You got that? Come on! Father, don't even think about letting that man marry my sister! Bill. You hear me? Get out! Father, 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 just do me a favor, and could you do this later? I, I just want to get... I need to get through to her here, okay? Thanks. I cannot believe 
that you were taking Hart's side on this. Nobody is taking side. Right, then you even let him anywhere near her right, after no, what he did to her. I know you're hurt and you're angry and your sister's really sick, but this isn't doing anybody any good. Now, like it or not, your sister still loves Hart, and I think Hart still no, has no, feelings. No, no, that is bull. No, no, it is not. You can love someone very deeply and not be able to be with them. Believe me, I know. And we all know that your sister is no saint. So, what, what, what does that mean? What I'm saying is that she, she hurt him as well. She did things to drive him away as well. They both made mistakes. Mistakes? Well, why didn't he just put a gun to her head and pull the trigger? I mean, it would have had the same effect, right? What happened before simply doesn't matter. Can't you see that? No, I can't. But go ahead, Mom. Just stick it to her again. What? Hey, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Vanessa, he's angry. He didn't mean that. Every decision that I've made has been wrong. If I had it to do over again, I would tell you that we had a daughter. Vanessa, we were kids, barely out of school. Plus, you had no reason to believe that you could depend on me. No, oh, but I didn't even try, did I? Because you knew, as I did. What? When you went away to stay with your aunt, I suspected that it was something important. Because you just don't pull up and go away like that, do you? pursued my suspicion, I would have found out about the baby, about Artina, and things that would have been so different. You're such a kind man. Oh, I've been such a terrible mother to her. Terrible. She's never once felt safe or secure. The way a child needs to. The way you I thought the twins couldn't have a better home than what they had with me and, and Blake, but... But what? Well, I threatened to file for sole custody, and Blake panicked, and she decided to run away with the kids. Oh, my God. Yeah. Somehow she ran into Hart, who talked her out of it, thank God. I mean, who knows what disaster would have happened. Now, listen, I know this sounds ridiculous and too optimistic, but I really do believe that you and Blake may be able to find your way back to each other. Yeah, I, I, you know, I don't really care who you get as long as they're there by 6 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, I'm going to be there. All right. <sighs> Never ends. Well, uh, maybe I could help you out with that. Are you good with him? No, I was talking about Lizzie's Playhouse. I think with everything that's going on, it might be best if I got somebody else to finish up the job. Best for who? Well, it would be one less thing to worry about, right? This doesn't have anything to do with your uh, conversation with Vanessa now, does it? It doesn't matter. Look, Bess has been through a lot, and it's been very stressful, and that's what you heard when she said those things to you. Could be. <laughs> Fear and frustration, that's that's what that was all about. So look, I don't want you feeling like you have to run the other way every time I'm walking in the room, right? Okay, okay, um, I, maybe, maybe I overreacted. Well, it's understandable, though, but just so that we know that we're all on the same wavelength, I'll say something to Vanessa. No, oh, <laughs> no, no, I'd rather you didn't. That would be really awkward and embarrassing. Okay, well, then, uh, 
we'll just uh, forget it. Never happened. Never happened. And about the playhouse. I happen to be the foreman on that job, and I'll be damned if I let anybody else finish my work, okay? Okay. Well, you will make Lizzie a very happy little girl. Good. Don't forget what I said. Vanessa, I have to tell you that there is no hope for my marriage. None. Oh, forgive me, but what in the world does Blake see in that man, that Benoit? I don't know, and I could care less. My only concern right now is the welfare of my kids. Well, what are you going to do? Are you going to sue for custody? I was, but now it's up to Blake. She was a lying, cheating wife, but it's now up to her to prove that she can at least be a decent 